ਯੂ ਐਸ ਆਈ ਬੀ ਸੀ ਯਾਨੀ ਯੂਨਾਈਟਿਡ ਸਟੇਟਸ ਇੰਡੀਆ ਬਿਜ਼ਨਸ ਕਾਉਂਸਲ ਅਤੇ ਯੂ ਐਸ ਚੈਂਬਰ ਆਫ ਕਾਮਰਸ ਦੇ ਸਾਂਝੇ ਸਹਿਯੋਗ ਨਾਲ 48ਵੀਂ ਸਾਲਾਨਾ ਜਰਨਲ ਮੀਟਿੰਗ ਤੇ ਇੰਡੀਆ ਆਈਡੀਆਜ਼ ਦੇ ਉੱਪਰ ਸਿਖਰ ਸੰਮੇਲਨ ਕੀਤਾ ਜਾ ਰਿਹਾ ਹੈ ਇਸ ਵਿੱਚ ਸ਼ਿਰਕਤ ਕਰਨ ਲਈ 21 ਗਾਇਸ ਲੈਬਸ ਤੋਂ ਪ੍ਰੈਜ਼ੀਡੈਂਟ ਕਮਲ ਅਲੂਵਾਲੀਆ ਜੀ ਆਏ ਹੋਏ ਨੇ ਕਮਲ ਜੀ ਤੁਹਾਡਾ ਬਹੁਤ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਵਾਗਤ ਹੈ ਥੈਂਕਸ ਫॉर ਹੈਵਿੰਗ ਮੀ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇੰਡੀਅਨ ਆਈਡੀਆ ਸਮਿਟ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਸ਼ਿਰਕਤ ਕਰ ਰਹੇ ਹੋ ਇੱਕ ਤਾਂ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਆਪਣੀ ਕੰਪਨੀ ਦੇ ਬਾਰੇ ਦੱਸੋ ਔਰ ਦੂਜਾ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਹੁਣ ਇਹ ਕਿਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਦੀ ਨਵੀਂ ਡਿਵੈਲਪਮੈਂਟ ਹੋ ਰਹੀ ਹੈ ਇਹਦੇ ਬਾਰੇ ਵੀ ਸਾਡੇ ਦਰਸ਼ਕਾਂ ਨਾਲ ਜਰੂਰ ਜਾਣਕਾਰੀ ਸਾਂਝੀ ਕਰੋ ਗ੍ਰੇਟ ਸੋ ਇਟ ਆਰ ਕੰਪਨੀ ਕੀ ਗਾਇ ਲੈਬਸ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਬਿਲਟ ਅ ਪਲੇਟਫਾਰਮ ਫॉर ਬਿਲਡਿੰਗ ਏਆਈ ਐਪਲੀਕੇਸ਼ਨਸ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਦਾ ਪ੍ਰੋਜੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਇਸ ਦੈਟ ਇਨ ਦਾ ਨੈਕਸਟ 5 ਟੂ 7 ਇਅਰਸ ਦੇ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਅਬਾਊਟ 1.5 ਬਿਲੀਅਨ ਐਂਟਰਪ੍ਰਾਈਜ਼ ਯੂਜ਼ਰਸ ਆਲ ਆਰ ਜੌਬਸ ਵਿਲ ਚੇਂਜ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਆਫ ਏਆਈ how we work what we work on will all change for the better be more opportunity created than ever before so with that as the backdrop the partnership between india and us is at a very exciting time they are both dependent on each other they are both doing well and ai is part of the i set agreement between them as one of the critical and emerging technologies then you next get to the point that uh, india has the largest youngest workforce in the world over 200 million people who are between the ages of 15 and 25 and as you look at all the demand for ai and skills it's a great opportunity for india imagine if those 200 million people were able to build ai applications India can absolutely equip their workforce to ride the AI wave in the next few years. And that's the exciting part and I think Prime Minister Modi's visit as well as you're seeing a lot of the uh, Biden administration here a lot of that is around the opportunity ahead for both sides. Par jis tarah nal chat GPT te ho re is tarah diyan jehdiyan eh applications naviyan aa rahiyan ne unna nal lokan de vich dar vi hega ke jobs chandiyan rehn gaya ede bare ki kahoge. so so no need to be fearful about it what i see is two parts of it if you don't know the details yes that leads to some fear so the better thing is to get educated to understand how the technology is working we do need guardrails so that we are building the right stuff and not actually hurting but that has happened with all technology uh, shifts right there's always a risk that some of it is misused now on the positive side chat gpt has woken the world up to realize what can be done how some of these things can be done better and that's the opportunity for us and in india as well because india has a lot of data with billion plus people and today they were sharing that while india has only 4% of the global gdp 40% of all the global digital transactions are happening in india so there's a lot to learn is a it's a young economy it's a fast growing economy if you bring ai to bring in the efficiency and opportunities sure. sky is the limit on what india can do over the next decade because if you think about the macro economics in our favor everybody who had manufacturing in china is thinking of china plus one strategy sure. india will be a beneficiary of that so how do you build the manufacturing base it'll come with a lot of automation a lot of applications of ai so that's what we can unlock with each other the technology that's in in us and the workforce that's in india eh jehdi pichle din de vich us state secretary ne statement ditti hai ke 191 billion dollar da trade india de nal hoya hai par jehde us ibc de as well as president ne ambassador atul kashyap oh kehnde ne ke limit 500 billion a billion dollar tak di yep. so inu kive dekhde very very achievable and just with they i hear a couple of numbers to think about last year 460 billion were spent on ai both infrastructure applications all that stuff and it's just the start this number itself is expected to grow to over a trillion dollars in the next few years So if India builds the workforce that is AI ready, AI enabled and building AI applications, how many of that uh, 1 trillion could actually be flowing through the Indian workforce? The value creation is great. The key thing that I'm interested in, 
because in the past, whenever technology shifts have happened, the wealth has stayed concentrated in the hands of few. Can we take more of our workforce with us so that they also get the benefit of AI? And yes, there's a fear of jobs uh, going away. They won't go away, but they will change. Industries will change, and that's the opportunity for us. You are the board of directors, Chamber of Commerce. How many sectors are you looking at the sector that are looking at possibilities? Almost every single one. Financial services, definitely agriculture, what we are growing, where we are growing, and how to improve the productivity yield there. Uh, manufacturing because uh, supply chain is getting disrupted. There is also a lot of interest in environmentally friendly materials now. So all these things were well established if you keep doing the same thing. But if you need to change, that requires you to rethink what can be done. And retail is changing, especially with COVID. We all understood how to buy online, right? So now that is also an enabler because some of the smaller businesses in India can also actually have now a bigger reach. They're not limited to where they are producing their goods or selling their goods. So each of these steps are an enabler to have a much broader opportunity than we have ever had before. And this is across the board. Punjab, which is the most important thing in the agriculture sector, the main thing is that everything depends on it. You said that the IT sector is the most important thing. पर असी चंडीगढ़ के पिछले साल गलबात शुरू हुई सू अगे नहीं तोर सके सो पंजाब की धरती या भारत के उत्थे किस तरह दभावनाव देखते हो सो देर आर कपल ऑफ थिंगस आई थिंक यू ऑलरेडी हैव अ लॉड ऑफ कॉन्सनट्रेशन ऑफ गुड कॉलेज एंड यूनिवर्सिटीज देयर विद इट्स पटियाला चंडीगढ़ लुधियाना जलंधर दे ऑल हैव वेरी गुड बेस फॉर एजुकेशन अमृतसर फस्ट पार्ट इज टू एक्चुअली मेक द education more current and it should be directed at getting the employment and careers going and also make it easy for people to be creative so that there are more opportunities whether it's any industry or manufacturing or agriculture any of these areas because more people get involved when they know that there is certainty and safety for their investment in their careers, right? So it's not just what will happen in the next two, three years, is that I can make a good living for the next 10, 20 years. It's the same thing in US also, right? So when you provide that confidence and you teach, give them the skills so that they are being, they are starting to think in terms of independence, confidence comes, creativity comes, and then you will see that we don't need to feed them. They are going to lead us and, very, and that change happens very quickly. So where I see is we have to get a critical mass of the right talent. Like pick Indiana wants to be a state known for manufacturing and science. Punjab needs to pick a field or two where we'll specialize in this. Could be pharmaceuticals, could be in manufacturing, could be anything. But a lot of manufacturing is moving into India. Maybe Punjab could be a center for that. Hmm. A lot of automation, more factories get set up, and that could be very symbiotic for the current businesses there. Absolutely. So, place a bet, then we teach the skills that are necessary for the workforce in Punjab to actually benefit from the businesses that are moving in, the factories that are being set up. Hmm. And they will be there, because all these investments are for the long term. They're not coming in for two to three years, they're coming for five, 10, 20 years. Hmm. You're seeing the in, uh, US government invest almost 50 billion in the CHIP Act mm. to bring semiconductor back to US, mm. right? Similarly, similar uh, programs can be held in Punjab to both create, bring the businesses, create the incentive and have long-term opportunity for the workforce there. And then we teach them and they'll take, you will be amazed what this younger generation is capable of doing. अलू अलिया साहब जिमें वर्ल्ड बैंक के अजय बंगा बैठे ने यू एस चैंबर ऑफ कॉमर्स के थोड़े जे लोग बैठे ने कि मैसेज दोगे साढ़े लोगों काफ़ी हद तक जी सिख कम्यूनिटी आ ओवरऑल होर कई तरह के कामों के उलझी हुई है असी अमेरिका के भी रह के अपने बच्चों उस किस्म की सिक्ख्या दे जिस किस्म की तुम इंडिया के कह रहे हो ज़्यादातर गिनती जो असी देखिए तो साढ़े जोड़े बिजनेस के लोग ने 
ਉਹ ਆਪਣੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਚਾਹੇ ਉਹ ਟਰੱਕਿੰਗ ਕੰਪਨੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਨੇ ਚਾਹੇ ਉਹ ਲਿਕਰ ਸਟੋਰਾਂ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਨੇ ਚਾਹੇ ਉਹ ਇਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਦੇ ਕੰਮਾਂ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਨੇ ਉਹ ਇਧਰਲੇ ਪਾਸੇ ਹੀ ਤੋਰੀ ਜਾ ਰਹੇ ਨੇ ਸੋ ਵਾਟ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਯੂਅਰ ਮੈਸੇਜ ਟੂ ਦੋਸ ਪੀਪਲ ਇਨ ਯੂ ਐਸ ਐਂਡ ਅਦਰ ਕੰਟਰੀਜ਼ ਇਨਕਲੂਡਿੰਗ ਇੰਡੀਆ ਅ ਗ੍ਰੇਟ ਕੁਐਸਚਨ ਆਲ ਗਿਵ ਯੂ ਅ ਸਲਾਈਟਲੀ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਆਨਸਰ in us and canada just like you said trucking business there is a dearth of truck drivers right and that is why you'll see the autonomous driving comes coming to trucks faster because you don't have enough truck drivers so the need will bring in automation and some of the most advanced technology will be moving into the transportation business industry that is the opportunity for all of us plus just look at the economics you can make a very good living if you actually have digital skills the quality of life is very good because most of the work can be done in a very nice environment you can have a work life balance and do good work and think about the impact today a lot of us are very interested not just in actually making our own taking care of our family but the impact that we can have on others around us can we take the rest of the workforce with us that's the opportunity and that's all by enabling them teaching them and unlocking their creativity not having to find the next uh, trucking or liquor store to just make the ends meet i think if we raise our expectations and let our ambition and uh, imagination go because ai will do that sky's the limit there's nothing stopping us from actually really prospering from this next uh, ai wave last i don't know either you would like to answer eh tade te hai je tusi theek samjhoge jawab de deo kyunki politics nal judya hoya hai dilip singh sond 1956 de vich congressman bane si us to baad assi rajniti de khetar de vich sada sikh bhai chara agge ne vach sakya eh de bare kuch kehna chahoge uh I don't think I know enough to make any intelligent comment on that. The only broad thing I'll say is uh administration is as important as getting to the top job. Meaning how to when you get there are you able to drive growth? Right and help why you got elected and got to the top job also comes with the responsibility now do what you said you would do. so more than anything i would talk about accountability and empowerment when that comes together good things happen right because that's all we want right from all they're saying we want leaders who will actually open more opportunities for us so i think that should be the expectation and then so more focus on capability and administration not just getting elected alu aliya sir thank you so much for your time tade diyan bahut sariyan gallan ਮੰਗ ਕਰਦੀਆਂ ਨੇ ਕਿ ਅੱਗੇ ਹੋਰ ਗੱਲਾਂ ਕੀਤੀਆਂ ਜਾਣ ਐਂਡ ਰਿਕੁਐਸਟ ਕਰਾਂਗੇ ਕਿ ਆਉਂਦੇ ਦਿਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਹੋਰ ਟਾਈਮ ਦਿਓ ਸੋ ਇਸ ਗੱਲ ਨੂੰ ਅੱਗੇ ਤੋਰਿਆ ਜਾਵੇ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਸੋ ਮੱਚ ਫਾਰ ਯੋਰ